Hi, I'm Tony Fleming, and this is Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Hey, Ray, thanks for joining us on today's video. This thing is cool, man. 89 Blazer, locally owned. We met the original owner that did this truck. Uh, 50,000 original miles, 56,000 original miles on it, driven a couple thousand miles a year. And as we walk around, man, it is really, really nice. Not to mention the inside has so many nice accoutrements and everything seems to work really nicely from the power windows to the power locks and stuff like that. So let's take a look at this right here. This is way nicer paint than circa 1986, 7, 8, 9 of, uh, of GM. Because at that time there, they had a lot of paint issues. So this truck here has been completely redone over on top of adding all of this in here. Now this right here was very expensive for its time and it screams of the 90s. You may love it, you may hate it. If you hate it, not a big deal. We can either paint the truck white down or we can go ahead and maybe keep the blue or we could just paint this color here, dark blue to match the inside of the car. We can do a couple little things for you, the truck, sorry, uh, um, and whatever you want, not a big deal. But it still looks pretty cool. But I wanted to show you some of the detail around it that you can't normally see, stuff like this in here. Like, look at all of how clean everything is in here. You can really see how low mileage this is. This has the big lift kit in it. It's a four inch lift kit. Check out these aluminum rims here. Uh, look to be 15 by 12s. Big Mickey Thompson, 35 by 17 and a half. That is a lot of wheel and tire in here, all right? Disc brakes inside, power disc brakes on top of it. This has uh, fuel injection as well as overdrive automatic transmission. Two speed transfer case. So this is like today's modern car but jacked up and uh, looks really, really cool with low mileage, and it's not a gazillion dollars, man. Keep in mind, this thing's a killer four-wheel drive vehicle for not a lot of money, all right? Let's keep rolling around for it. You got the step tubes to make it easy to get inside, okay? Come back here and let's check out some of the detail for the suspension here as well. Check out the shock system and ride system here just to make sure that everything stays together, and it's detailed very nicely as well. I think the wheels and tires have held up got the cap on it here. You know, one of the things that a lot of people do, they put a soft top on here or a bikini top on, because this comes off, that, my friends, is a whole lot of fun. Then this becomes this cool beach car. All right, come back here. So I want you to keep seeing stuff, like the paint job. Probably four to $5,000 to get this done. You got the stainless bumper here with the built-in reverse lights and what have you. Got a tow ball, and then under here, all detailed nicely. We can flip the Mickey Thompson white letters out if you wanted them, or we can just leave them black walls. Look at the big 12 bolt rear in there. That's a lot of meat. Look at the size of this bolt, jeez. Okay, keep going. All right, so uh, Randy Kerr's painted this car. We know him, he's a local uh, painter, uh, pretty legendary. Fuel injection, what we talked about. We keep walking around. This is really a nice truck, and I gotta tell you, for the money, it is amazing, amazing. The fact that you can take the top off, have full convertible or throw a bikini top on there, and once we get inside, I want to show you some of the cool stuff because that's a custom-built roll bar, color matched to the truck. And again, we, I keep stressing the 50,000 miles on it, local owner, okay? All right, let's take a peek under the hood and see what kind of motivation you're going to get. But I want to show you this too. This has a, uh, a mount for a winch, okay? And the rollers for the winch cables to go right through there. So this would be uh, uh, pretty cool to, to get something like that done if you wanted to, all right? Driving lights are built in, still has a great mug, custom grill. Let me pop the hood for you real quick. All right, let's take a peek under the hood for a second. All right, so this is kind of cool because the reason I'm going to show you this is everything is easy to get to, everything is easy to see, but what I wanted you to see was the most important part, and that says to you, what do I get? Am I really getting a low mileage, a well taken care of vehicle? Well, here's a good indicator of that. For instance, like these are the original stickers that would have come on the vehicle circa 1989. They're still in place and easily readable. If this thing had 150 or 200,000 miles, these things would have already burned off and all those things would have happened. The block in itself looks really good over here. It's got the headers on it for free flow dual exhaust system, which we're gonna hear, which sounds really great as well. Power steering, power disc brakes, uh, air conditioning, um, all the things that we forget to ask about. Here's a modern, uh, you know, modern accoutrement car with all kinds of nice features, but in a cool old school body, all right? All right, so let's check out the inside because out here is really, really nice. The inside is just as great. Even this original stickers here giving you uh, the 5.7 liter with the fuel injection and the horsepower you get there. All right, so here's the inside and here we are. That sounds annoying and I'll tell you what, that may sound annoying, but who cares? And I'll tell you why, because this is where everything shines on a vehicle that's well taken care of, where the things like that stuff work. All right, so some other upgrades. Got a nice LaCara wheel in it. Okay, leather wrapped four spoke. 
Got a great stereo, man. This is nice. Okay, so little stuff like this. Power windows. Power locks. Okay, like all this stuff is working, man. Full gauges on the dash here. This is that cool roll bar I told you about, recovered and matching material. Back seat back here looks like a lot, a lot of fun. Check that out. Makes it easy to get out. And like I said, off goes the top, but this is here for a reason. This is designed to protect everybody in the truck in case of rollover. That's why they put all this in here. The cap comes off, you've got hand grab handles there. This is a super, I'm gonna tell you what, man, this is a great deal on a vehicle. That's a lot, a lot of fun. Um, the rear window's power, slides back down. Air conditioning, which we talked about, the upgraded stereo, goes on and on. So anyway, uh, how about I start it for you so you can hear what it sounds like. And the fuel injection is really nice too. I don't have to touch the gas pedal. And that fresh dual exhaust sounds really nice, especially when you're getting on it. You know, in closing up a video like this, this can cost somewhere in the $40,000 range to build something like this. With the lift kit, the wheels and tires, the upgraded stereo, the roll bar, the custom paint job, all that stuff, and 50,000 original miles on it makes it an awesome, awesome buy. I'll tell you what, if you want just a cool car for not a lot of money, this 89 Blazer 4x4 is it. Call us, 301-816-1000, and we'll tell you all about it.